Today, let's see how we can write a lambda expression for a method with two arguments. So currently, we are having an interface operation with an abstract method add, which contains two arguments and it returns this sum. And this is how the implementation looks like. So what I will do is I will copy this particular part or let me simply cut from here and paste it something like this. Now I don't need this IMPL part. So let me remove it from here and same thing I can remove from here also. So on executing, we can see that currently it is working fine. Now, as always, let's remove this operation. And now I hope you are pretty much clear that we need to remove this part also. So from below, let's remove this particular one also. Now here we don't need these curly braces because again, this is just a single statement. So let me remove this particular part. Also, let me remove this return keyword. And here what I can do is I can just add a arrow and it is going to become a lambda expression. On executing, as you can see, this is still working fine. But here the thing is, can we remove these brackets or can we remove this data type? Let's see. So what I will do is I will just copy this particular part and paste below. So now I have pasted the same code two more times. And as you can see that we are still getting the right output. Now what I will do is I will try to remove both the data types from this particular one. Now can I remove these brackets? The answer is no. This time the brackets are used to bring both the arguments together. That's why we can't remove these brackets. Otherwise it will still look odd. Now, what if I remove only one of the data types from here? So the rule is that we can't remove only some of the data types. Either we need to keep all the data types or we need to remove all the data types. You can't mix two things. That's why this third one is not going to work. And this time, if I try to execute, obviously it will give me a compilation error for the last one. Thanks.